Okay, welcome, welcome to the Oz Kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where we cook meals in yeah, minutes. Yeah, yeah. We the oh, 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 oh. triple up. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. So, sorry. What are we making aujourd'hui? Well, yes. today mm. we're making what we're doing is the art of using your leftovers. Yes. So when you say cooking in meals, it's just meals that are supposed to make your life yeah. chop chop. Easy. Easy. But then yummy and yeah. looks good mm. and make, makes your guests think like, oh my God. You're so innovative. Like, oh my God. Do you do that? You've All done right. a lot. Wow. Okay, okay, let's stop. <laughs> <laughs> so we have, we have leftover brown fried rice. rice. Yes. Remember that one? Yes. And then we have leftover cauliflower rice. Rice. Yes. Remember that one too. And so this is leftover rice. And then here we have pre-boiled chickpeas mm -hmm. from Nairobians by the way. Shout out to Nairobians uh, that we're going to stir fry here very quick. Very quickly. And what you just had is the oven was preheating for 10 minutes so that it's ready. So for we're going us. to use the oven just so you know. Yeah. Hack number one. <laughs> You know, I always, I'm always ready with a hack, mm. you know? Always have your hohos, your different hohos, yes. your red one, your green one, yeah. and your yellow one. Just always have it. It will save you. Mm. So this vegetable, which is very rich actually, mm. will be our base for yeah. everything. Everything right here. Yes. So as you see, we have like removed the inside, which mm -hmm. is not massive. It's just like protrudes from the, from the top. Yeah. That's the stem over there. Just remove it, remove it. And we're going to stuff this over here inside inside mm. okay. i'm just gonna give my chickpeas a little bit of pizzazz thank you baby so we're gonna she's going to do that as i pulse the onions and then save your tears guys save your tears so onions because uh, she's going to need the onions it's done so you're gonna put the onions there yeah once you're done, give it back to me so that I can pass the carrots for you. Exactly. Pass me a spoon, please. Here we go. And you need a... You want to use this? Oh, okay. Yeah. So this is already done. So, Ash, can I start stopping? Yes, you may, honey. <laughs> Actually, please. Yeah, By time. all means. There you go. So babe, I think we're going, I think we should stuff uh, two of each because there are six. Yes. That people who is entering my eye. I know. I am yeah, here yeah. with you. So, so I'm gonna two of these, two of these and two of that. Yes. Okay. So I will add the pizzazz Which on my chickpeas, add carrots. It's the same thing, so I didn't need to have to rinse it really. And like this, as you can see, the quantity is quite a lot. So I can easily just put this in the fridge and use it for something else after. And that's how you always end up having food in the fridge. So yeah, I'm just stuffing the food in here. Yeah. And this, this one also has peppers inside. So. I am going now to put in some of my peppers. Also, add some sweet corn. Ooh, are we going to do the hack? What hack? Of the sweet corn. Which is hack number two. Hack number two. Madam okay. hack. <laughs> you just put it on a chopping board and just slash it. Then you don't have to go through the whole process. I didn't even know about this hack. Either. Oh, that way. Yes. <laughs> Instead of you trying to do one by one, yeah. you just do that. I'm sure many people don't know this. You taught me this. I yeah. taught you this. Yeah. yeah. You're welcome, baby. I didn't say thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you anticipated the Of more. course. Thank you. Okay, so Yay. that's one stuffing. Do you want to use this for something else? The corn? I want to use that. The corn? Okay, you can stay with that. Cauliflower. There you go. So that is done. So stuff two more with cauliflower. Yes. I'm going to put some garlic powder. Please, if you have fresh uh, garlic, put garlic. This is the menu, Apa Puan. Apa? Again, allow your ancestors to talk to you. Oh, whatever nice. works for you. And I love some cinnamon on my chickpeas. There's something that would work really well with this kind of uh, dish, if I may call it. Some paprika. Mm -hmm. Is uh, a melting cheese on top. Exactly. So, yeah. if you want to put in some cheese, please yeah. do. Yeah. It is fantastic.
Remember, our chickpeas were already cooked. So is the corn. So it's just a matter of just allowing everything just to... The oven is preheated. It's ready. It's ready. And we just stuff. Okay, right. so I'm going to stuff them in the oven nicely. So we have six of them, so I'm going to put them systematically. <laughs> uh, which color is this? Oh my god! <laughs> and, yeah, so I'll put it at around one. Okay, the oven is ready, the food is ready, and uh, it is smelling very nice. So am I going to assume, yes. There you go. Yeah. Voila. Voila. That's it. It is ready? Please indulge, and eat the green one. Okay, let me eat the <laughs> green one. The it's... rest of colors were there, guys, if you didn't notice. It is red, yellow, and green. Rastafari. Ho, ho, ho. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm.